I'm always in awe being in a landscape like this. There's something about hearing the sounds, seeing the sights that just remind you how important it is to be in touch with this world. It just kind of forces itself on you, that introspection. Beartooth Mountain Ascent takes place on my family's ranch. We have young men that come with anxiety and depression as well as uh, substance abuse issues. You put them into creation. We go up into the mountains. We put them on a horse. We have them in front of cattle pushing the cows. Our program is designed to discern truly where these men's gifts are and help them to come to realize what they are actuate them and send them on their way with those gifts firmly held in their hands and hearts. Before I came out here, it was, it was tough. I started with uh, prescription pills and uh, ended up with harder stuff. I wouldn't do things because I was, I was afraid that me giving my whole was not enough, that it wasn't good enough. I just couldn't stand that. Many of these guys have totally isolated themselves from the very people that love them the most. You have to give them something greater to think about that's a part of them. The camaraderie, the brotherhood, you know, it's, it's like being in a second family. It just gives you a chance to understand where your mind is and where it could be if you go about it the right way. When we're out there and we're working, it's important for them to recognize we don't want you to outdo anybody. We just want you to be you. My confidence is way up. I mean, the first two, three months I was here, I didn't talk to anyone. Climbing the mountains, being in this landscape teaches you that even if you are a small player, you can still make a big difference you can still conquer those mountains. They need to go beyond themselves. And that's why nature is so powerful, is because nature naturally draws us out of ourselves. We see them unshackle from the prison that they created. All of a sudden they discover that I can beat this. I'm not powerless against it and there is hope.